Well, may the peace of the risen Christ be with you. Today I'm happy to welcome Joe Diaz of our parish, who is our parish council chair at the moment. Joe has uh, served in our parish in a number of different capacities on the school commission and also worked very hard uh, as one of the scout leaders. So I wanted to ask Joe to come today to share with us a little bit about our last parish council meeting when we began to talk about the notion of pilgrimage. Not just any kind of a journey that we're on, but one that might take us to a place or time where we can experience true renewal in our hearts. So Joe, tell us a little bit about that parish council meeting and some of the key points that uh, we may have come up with. Uh, thank you, Father, for this opportunity. And I'd like to uh, say hello to all of our parishioners who might be viewing this and to reassure you that even in this time of unknown and as we're uh, dealing with this uh, COVID-19 break in crisis, it's affected all of us in very different and stressful ways, including myself. And as you can see, those of you that know me, uh, I've been working from home for over a month now and I haven't shaved. And so this beard is new. Uh, but in our last parish council meeting, uh, which we are still conducting, although we're doing it by uh, new technology through Zoom, uh, last Thursday was our latest meeting and a discussion that we had uh, amongst our parish council members and with Father is how the inability to participate as a community in Mass and in the sacraments in the Eucharist, how that affects all of us and how in the future with the unknown, when will we all be back here in church together to celebrate? And we thought that a good analogy is one of a pilgrimage. And we're familiar with different pilgrimages, pilgrimages that are around uh, throughout the world in, in time. And one that was discussed is the Santiago de Camino pilgrimage over in Spain and how some parishioners have done that and how we would like to liken our circumstances to that of a pilgrimage. And that here someday, hopefully soon, uh, on our journey together, we will all be back here to celebrate the Eucharist and the end of a pilgrimage. And uh, what we like to also encourage as part of our discussion is other groups that meet here in the parish community that they also continue to meet and, and find ways to reach out so people know that we are still a community, we are still a parish, and we are all still here together, and we need to go on this journey together. Thank you, Joe, and I think with that, we'll close with our prayer. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, you once walked with your disciples on the road to Emmaus. Sometimes, like them, we too feel discouraged and overwhelmed. But you opened their hearts by reminding them of the great stories of the Bible and how God was always present in his life-giving actions and presence. Open our hearts now. Help us to see with the eyes of faith that you are with us on our journey of life. Nourish us with your presence in your word and in the Eucharist, which we long for so that we may share with our brothers and sisters your message of peace, joy, love, and life. Amen. Have a blessed day.